The history of the human being, century by century, starting with the first century and ending with the 21st century. If we go back to the first century marked a huge turning point, a time that laid the foundation of modern civilization. Imagine a world witnessing the expansion of one of the greatest empires in history, the mighty Romans. With their architectural prowess, legal systems, and cultural influence, they left an indelible mark on the world that still echoes in our modern societies. But that's not all. This era also saw the birth of a faith that would shape the course of humanity for the next 2,000 years, Christianity. Emerging from a small sect in the Middle East, it grew, against all odds, into a religion that would span continents and cultures. This was a century of beginnings, of seeds sown that would grow and shape the world in ways unimaginable. Thus, the first century set the stage for the unfolding drama of human history. As we move into the second to the fifth century, we witness the rise and fall of empires and the dawn of enlightenment. Intricate networks of trade like the famed Silk Road stitched together the continents, bringing not only goods, but also ideas and cultures to places far and wide. As Rome's power waned in the west, new powers emerged, reshaping the world map. Meanwhile, in the east, the Gupta Empire in India flourished. This golden age saw a surge in scientific, artistic, and philosophical thought, shedding light on the path of human progress. From the mathematics of Aryabhata to the timeless tales of Kalidasa, the Gupta period left an indelible mark on human history. These centuries saw the intermingling of cultures and the spread of knowledge, shaping the world as we know it. Such was the era of empires and enlightenment, a testament to humanity's ceaseless quest for understanding and advancement. The 6th to the 10th century was a time of contrast, marked by the Dark Ages in Europe and the Islamic Golden Age. As Europe grappled with the fall of Rome, a new age of exploration was set in motion by the intrepid Vikings. Their longships touched shores from North America to the Caspian Sea, expanding our understanding of the world. Simultaneously, the Islamic Golden Age was in full bloom. Scholars in Baghdad, Cordoba, and beyond preserved ancient knowledge while making groundbreaking strides in fields from astronomy to medicine. These advancements, including the invention of the astrolabe, would later guide explorers to distant lands. In the heart of Europe, Charlemagne's reign marked the beginning of a unified continent, setting the stage for the Europe we know today. In these centuries, we see the immense human capacity for exploration and enlightenment, even in the face of darkness. From the 11th to the 15th century, the world was marked by religious conflict, vast conquests, and significant technological advancements. The Crusades, a series of religious wars, ignited centuries of conflict, reshaping the political landscape of Europe and the Middle East. Meanwhile, the Mongol Empire, under the rule of Genghis Khan and his successors, connected the East to the West, creating a vast network of trade and cultural exchange. But perhaps one of the most transformative developments of this era was the invention of the compass. This seemingly simple tool revolutionized navigation, guiding seafarers across uncharted waters. It was the compass that guided Zheng He's treasure fleets, heralding the age of exploration. These centuries marked the rise of global exploration and the interconnection of cultures. As we venture further in our journey, we see how these events set the stage for the world as we know it today. The 16th to the 18th century brought a renaissance of arts and knowledge, sparking revolutions in the age of reason. This epoch, known as the Renaissance, saw a rebirth of classical learning and a profound shift in artistic style, giving rise to masters like Michelangelo and Leonardo da Vinci. Meanwhile, the Enlightenment era championed reason and individualism, shaking the foundations of traditional authority. Thinkers like Voltaire and Rousseau challenged established norms, setting the stage for political upheaval. The American and French revolutions, driven by cries for liberty, equality, and fraternity, further reshaped the world, giving birth to modern democratic systems. These centuries marked a turning point where the human spirit yearned for progress and change. The legacy of these times is profound, influencing our concepts of freedom, governance, and human rights. These centuries marked the birth of modern political systems and the rise of scientific thought. The 19th century ushered in an era of rapid industrialization and imperial expansion. 
the rumblings of steam engines and clanging of metal became the symphony of progress as the industrial revolution revamped societies with innovative technologies from cotton mills to railways the world was suddenly moving faster connecting people and places in unprecedented ways meanwhile the world map was being redrawn empires stretched their dominion across continents their thirst for power and resources seemingly insatiable this age of empire was a time of exploration and exploitation forever altering the cultural and political landscapes of the colonized regions innovation and imperialism two defining features of the 19th century brought about profound changes the fruits of industry were bittersweet bringing prosperity for some and hardship for others the legacies of empires both majestic and menacing remain etched in the contours of our modern world this century set the stage for the modern world with its technological advancements and political complexities the 20th century was a time of great upheaval and remarkable achievements it opened with a world at the brink where nations drawn into the vortex of alliances and rivalries plunged into the first world war it was a conflict on a scale never seen before a grim testament to the destructive power of industrialization yet this war to end all wars was just the prelude a mere two decades later the world was once again caught in the throes of conflict this time even more devastating the second world war was a global cataclysm that redefined the very concept of war it stretched from the beaches of normandy to the islands of the pacific from the sands of north africa to the icy expanse of russia and it ended with the unimaginable power of the atomic bomb, a haunting reminder of humanity's capacity for destruction. But the, the 20th century was not just a century of wars. It was also a century of wonders. The same technology that fueled the engines of war also launched humanity into the cosmos. The moon landing in 1969 was a triumph not just for the United States, but for all of humankind. It was proof that we as a species could overcome immense challenges and reach for the stars. And then, as the century neared its end, another monumental event unfolded, the fall of the Berlin Wall. This was not just a physical barrier coming down, it was the symbolic end of the Cold War, a promise of a world moving towards unity and cooperation. Despite its challenges, the 20th century showcased the indomitable human spirit and our ability to achieve great feats. From the ashes of war rose innovations that transformed our lives. From the depths of conflict emerged the desire for peace and understanding. And from the reach of our ambition, we touched the moon. The 20th century was indeed a time of wars and wonders, a testament to our capacity to destroy and our determination to build. The 21st century has brought us into the digital age, a time of unprecedented connection and global challenges. We've stepped into a world where boundaries have blurred and the digital revolution has redrawn the map of human interaction. The internet, once a novelty, has become a necessity, intricately woven into the fabric of our everyday lives. Social media platforms have emerged as virtual town squares, places where ideas are exchanged, relationships are forged, and movements are born. They've given voice to the voiceless and power to the people democratizing information like never before. But as with any tool, it's not without its downsides. The same platforms that unite us can also divide, and the line between fact and fiction can sometimes blur in this digital landscape. Alongside this digital dawn, we're grappling with a challenge of a different kind, climate change. The rise of technology has brought with it an increased awareness of our impact on the planet. Satellite images reveal melting ice caps, while data from across the globe paints a picture of a world heating up. This environmental crisis has sparked a revolution of its own, as scientists, innovators, and everyday citizens alike search for solutions to sustain our shared home. At the intersection of the digital revolution and the fight against climate change, we find the power of connection. Social media campaigns have rallied support for environmental causes, while digital technology has allowed scientists to collaborate on climate research across continents. As we continue to navigate this century, we contribute to the ongoing narrative of human history. Each tweet, each scientific discovery, each small act of green living is a sentence in the story of our time. 
and while the challenges we face are great, so too is our capacity for innovation, adaptation, and change. The 21st century may be a time of digital dawn and environmental dusk, but it's also a time of opportunity, a chance to shape the future of our planet and our place within it.